Ah, smell that salt, spice, and sin, Captain. The Indian Ocean holds many secrets and mysteries. The smuggling den of St. Anne is one of its hidden gems. Whatever a pirate needs, this place has it in stock. St. Anne is where we turn our luck into fortune, friend. Skurlock can get us started. That letter is proof your pirate worth a lick of salt. Hey, don't look at me. You're the best pirate to win Skurlock over. Me? Ah, yeah. I had my shot in the past. We don't need Skurlock's loyalty to gain infamy and influence. Only his connections. A proper ship would be a start. Unless you want to keep cozying up on your Dao. I'll stay by the ship while you tread shore. Pay no mind to the bottom feeders, Captain. Remember, we answer only to the winds of fate. <laughs> This one isn't going to make it. The little twig will snap within days. Days? That carcass is just about falling apart. And reeks of whale piss. This one here survived the wreck. Sure looks like it. A survivor? Come on in, Callie. Get it done. We'll never show your ugly mug again. You useless kit. The British wrecked my ship, sank my cargo, but shut you out! Hope you're not worthless. I really needed those goods. You see, this port rises on Chulin's patronage. And that merchant's so rich he pisses liquid gold. All I receive is a letter. That fucker wipes his ass to smear my face. I send a full haul of goods, and his demands triple. I'll need more captains. A nose for a bargain, have you? I can set you up with some traders, but you'll need a much larger hold. Cully, I saw that little tub you washed up in. It's halfway to Flotsam. You got spirits, but you're not ready yet. Now you want to get out of those rags and into a real ship? Then build your reputation and earn the people's respect. Good things will follow. You do that, and I can make you the most infamous pirate in all the seas. Off you go. We'll see each other soon. Ah, so you're the kelp that washed ashore from the wreck of the Exeter. Skerlock may see potential in you, but all I see is a would-be pirate with salt in their breeches. Tell me, what does the pirate king see in someone as ragged as yourself? Why would others sail with a captain with one leaky boat to their name? But if you prove your worth, even the waves will bend to your will. I expect you be wanting a pet on the back, treasure in your boots, and John Skellog's warm embrace. Ha! Saint Anne would sooner slit your throat than be called your paradise. I can build you the mightiest ship in the Indian Ocean, 
like I did for Skerlock with his Margareta. But how you steer it into the waves is up to you, Captain. A pirate steers their own ship, but how it fares in a monsoon depends on its maker. Visit my friend, Zane, the carpenter, and he will help you craft the tools needed for harvesting shipbuilding materials. Ujambo, you have been floating on a splinter of luck so far. If you measure infamy by the weight of your purse, St. Anne is the right place. We can help each other. You bring me quality materials and I'll make you the best tools on the Red Isle. That way, both our names will grow. on steady ground. You have come many leagues since searching for scraps on the coast. If you have the silver, I will gladly sell you designs stolen from mercantile dogs. With the right materials, you can build a ship to rival their best. to call your own and a shoreline calling to good fortunes. Speak to Thomas the blacksmith next. Unless you plan on ramming your vessel into the next companion boat, he will build you cannons to sink your enemies instead. I normally wouldn't give a nobody like you the steam off my piss on a good day. But I saw your ship's got nothing sticking out of her gun ports. Hungry little gubby, aren't you? Be careful you don't nibble on company, bait. They'll gut you from stir to bow. The extra crash has left us short on supplies. The company knows this, so they're squeezing us tighter. 
Bring me supplies and I'll build you weapons to skewer those frogs. Before you can take a bite out of the company, you need to have teeth. Right now, you're toothless. You need provisions. You'll have to get them yourself. Now, get cracking, mate. These furry cannons, they'll pierce through those dainty company hulls. So, you got your deck scrubbed, cannon swab, and your loins girded. Good. It's time you rumbled with the company ships. The cocky pricks keep helping themselves to my iron. Blast them to bits. Captain, grab your spyglass so we can identify those French leeches. Thank you. 
rubbing your belly. Bentar lagi kita akan pulang. Those frogs barely put up a fight, eh? You did good, mate. Tales of your victory grow taller with every talon. Now you've impressed the other parts in St. Anne. They're looking to deal with you. I've also got more jobs if you're up to it. 